Hello, Tim Carter back with another product review, and today it's my pleasure to review the V-Pick. V-Picks are guitar picks that have been constructed out of a special blend of heat-treated acrylics that provide an unbelievable non-slip surface, a more robust tone, and a longer lifespan. The pick is actually also designed to help you become a better guitar player without becoming cumbersome. It does all this without any resins or ridges in the pick. They just look great. Stick around later in the video, you're going to hear some audio examples of the different V-Picks that I was given that I found to be effective with my playing style. For now, let's take a closer look at the V-Pick as I explain more detail. The blend of acrylic materials creates a natural surface grip quality that has to be played to be believed. The grip sticks to your skin in a way that you don't even notice. This element of the design was important when you consider that these picks are designed in part to help you examine and improve your technique. So not having to divert my attention to my grip allowed me to focus on my playing 100%. Playing through my assortment, the common trait that I found was that these picks will keep you honest by exposing areas of your playing that need improvement. But these picks have a unique way of guiding your right hand into playing more effectively while seemingly making your picking motion more effortless. I was able to feel my attack more acutely and found myself picking through longer passages without fatigue. It may sound strange, but these picks added an almost natural compression to my tone, and much bigger tones in general, especially when playing high-gain rhythms. I used the stiletto picks for an edgier sounding rhythm with a heavy attack. The screamer and dimension picks were great for picking articulation, and the chick pick added a fat tone to jazz leads with the perfect amount of percussive attack. Each pick I tried brought something different in terms of tone. Going back to my nylon jazz picks and traditional size synthetic tortoise shell sounded very dull in comparison to the V picks version of the same shapes. Later you will see a video using a Fender Telecaster that compares the nylon jazz picks with the V pick equivalent and also a stiletto for contrast. It was very easy to adapt to almost all the styles of picks in my assortment. I felt that most of the picks were allowing at least one advantage or more, and more versatile picks were either exploiting my strengths or exposing me to things I needed to work on. It was the first time I had used a tool that was able to show me specifically how to practice more effectively to improve my personal approach. Let's listen to some examples of some of my favorite V picks and how they react to my style using a clean and distorted tone picking pattern. A little later you will also hear a rhythm example followed of course by the jazz pick comparison.
Thank you.